Hey guys, we are doing another video, and today I am going to show you guys how to multiply. And it's actually very easy. It's one of the easiest things I can think of um, in math. So, what I'm going to have to write upside down, which is kind of hard. So, say it was 37. This is very hard. I'm sorry if I... Did I write... The, I wrote the 7 backwards. Okay, I need... <laughs> okay. So, it's... Like that. Okay. 37 times... Um... How about... 40... 6... Oh, wait, no, that's going to be way too hard for you guys. Um, if you guys are beginners, do not do that. Okay, I can't write upside down anymore. I'm going to just do this. I can write sideways. I do it, like, every day. So I'm going to write it down, and then I'm going to show you guys. So say it was, uh, I'll show you the first trick in math. If, so 37 times 0 equals that the zeros and the ones are probably the easiest things in multiplication because when you do this it's always just going to equal zero because it's zero times so it's going to be zero and 37 times one that's going to be easy because it's only one time so it's just going to be itself so it's 37 and i'll show you this times this times table i have I have this times table from school. See, it has all these times things. So, so say it, but I'm going to get a little bit harder. Like, let's see. How about, like this one isn't, so it's four times seven. That would just be easy. So, really, what multiplication is, is just doing... So, it's going to be 4, and then you just have to count by 4s, really. You, the first number, you just have to count by that. So, 4, and then it's 8, and now... And, or you could do it the faster way, so that's 4, 8, 12... And you have to do the 7 times, so it's 4, 8, 12... 16, <coughs> and then I'm way, I'm, I'm like curving this for some reason. Um, 16, 20, 24, that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and then 28. So you figure it out, it's 28. Or you could do it the faster way. So you know it equals 28 already. You could do it the faster way though, well... And you could just turn it around. 7 times 4. It will still equal the same thing. It just turned around. So, so that looks like a plus sign. So, it's 7 times 4. You just have to do, you just have to do uh, 7. And then it's 14. And then after that is 23. I meant 21. What am I saying? 21. One, I think, yeah, 21, and then 7 more equals 28. So you're going to know for sure that it equals 28. And here's another one. I'm going to show you how to multiply by 9. So this is probably one of the easiest ones, too. So, but I only know how to do it if it's under 10, 10 or under. So I'm going to show you, like, 9 times 6. So you're going to put all your fingers up, and you're going to be looking like this. And so it's 9 times 6. You're going to count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and put your 6 finger down so it like divides it into groups. So there's 5 on this side, so it's 50-something, and 4 on this side, so it's 54. So now I know that equals 54. And also another really easy trick is count is by 10 so 4 times 10 you're just gonna delete the 1 you're just gonna delete the 1 and turn that into a 4 so it's 40 so that's pretty much how you multiply and I hope you guys let 
understood and please like and subscribe so bye guys and leave a thumbs up bye and put down in the comments if you have any confusion can if you have any confusion with any other math thing and i will i will make a video on it if i know how to do it and i will give a shout out to you so bye guys see you in the next video